all, this is Extreme, and today I'm going to show you a couple of two against two matches. Uh, let's see, uh, this one with Carsten is still available. And then we got this one with Fox Air, and one with the Kuba. I'm going to show you all three of them, except for this one. This guy uh, against an AI, uh, well, let's just say he went mass Dragonfly, so we lost. He was the one guarding the hill. And, uh, as strange as it may sound, I did the same on the convert side. He ranked well off the convert. I got the hill and I actually managed to hold. Well, actually, that, that's the goal. If you're on the left side, you need to hold. But uh, we are not going to show that. No, we're going to show this one. Me and Carson against uh, Kafsa from the Clan Scorpion and Captain Nayup. <coughs> Excuse me, I'm developing a cold. Okay, so I, I'm over there, and Carson is over there. It's a relative short game. Uh, I don't think he uh, finds this match uh, interesting. I'm going to shoot anyway. There will be some heroes at a certain point. Not sure if it is this map, but I'm, uh, they might uh, cure. Okay, uh, so uh, Carson is having trouble. He has only two crates on this side. Uh, well, we are rushing to see. The, uh, uh, I too had only one crate, and this is my second. Well, I'm going to fight for these, though, and um, all these in the water are mine. <laughs> this one is going to be mine. <laughs> yes, kill my diamond. But <laughs> now you're dead. <laughs> yeah, the crate is mine. <laughs> okay, um. That Kaiman is almost dead. He's going to retreat as much as possible, letting uh, Carson be point man, I guess. I didn't know. Okay, going to explore. The one on the right is weak. Oh no! Oh no! Shooting torpedo platform, placing mines! Yes, and the torpedo platform is finished! In two ways, but um, Green is going to help, and my Kaiman die against uh, Green's. Uh, well, actually, Teal, because it was Teal. Uh, well, they are very strong. Uh, meanwhile, I had this crate. I'm going to explore a little bit more. I think I didn't know. Oh, there's an assault. Let's kill the assault. I think an assault is dead now. I'm moving around. Not sure why. But I'm moving around over here. Positioning over there. I mean, a lot of delta are secured. And we are not going to build guns anymore. That would be silly and stupid. Now we are actually producing alligators, yes! There we go, okay, so there is a viking over here, and he's dead! Uh, three against one, and uh, one alligator has taken half the damage. Well, these guys are relatively strong. Uh, I am playing this as rank 22, okay, so another viking has died, another, uh, two more vikings approaching. Oh, wait, make that three against two against three. No, it's two against three. Oh, it's three against one. Uh, look at how fast the uh, exchange changes. Retreat. <laughs> well, I told him to retreat as well. Uh, I just knew that the retreat was not an option for the one alligator, so I just sacrificed it so that Carson could retreat his two alligators. Therefore, no. I can move to point G. It's got point H. Move to point A. <coughs> okay, so Teal is actually doing a hammer rush. Well, not that rush. Just, just a small attack, but he fails. Casting uh, drone forces. And a lot of vibes. Look at this. Check this. Let's zoom in a bit. Let's uh, slow down a bit. <laughs> oh, okay, uh, two times speed then. Huh? A little water splashing. Yes, uh, so they are going to take this crate. Unfortunately, it's going to disappear soon. Meanwhile, I'm taking this one. I got porcupines, a couple of coyote and two riflemen. And a lot of Vikings are going to attack. Okay, let's zoom out a bit. Yeah, I'm going to help defend, but uh, that uh, torpedo platform is key in this. Uh, there's also a hawk just flying over a bit. Meanwhile, I am producing more alligators in order to help. I'm uh, getting a torch. I got three shipyards producing, you guys. Three shipyards. 
Yeah, well, this one is a very decent match, I guess. Four more minutes remaining until the match is over. It will be very sudden, I guess. I don't know. Well, they lost a lot of flying, they're retreating a bit. Um, meanwhile, Carson will be flying around with his hog, not knowing what to do. Um, this Viking is going to die. <clears throat> two more Vikings, yes, let's kill them. Five against two, five against one, six against one, six against two, six against. No, wait, that's five again. And one retreating. And a lot of arcs flying, damaging this Viking. He is retreating. Affirmative. So I am going to do a little bit of a tactical thing. They know that uh, Carson is over here. Blue is going to defend. Uh, help defend Teal. That's Teal's Viking. Okay, Teal lost a shipyard. Lost a Viking. Look, Blue is going to help. Oh no, Blue is such a good ally. Well, oh, you know what? Let's move in from the left side. <laughs> <laughs> and Blue doesn't know what to do. This time he's going to lose his shipyards. That's okay. Green is performing a massive attack on Carson with uh, Zeus and the uh, heavy souls and maybe a couple of normal souls. Carson's doing his utmost best in defending. That's okay. Meanwhile, I just kill Blue with everything I got. So I'm sending in my Coyote and one Dragonfly. Two riflemen and apparently a lot of pocket pines. Six and two jaguars. Okay, that's more than enough. I guess a blue is down for the count and he's going to finish off with ground forces. Sending in my alligators to teal in order to destroy the remaining stuff he has. And um, Carson successfully defended against teal. And the ground is all thanks to those uh, hawks. They are very effective against Zeus. So there we have it. Uh, 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 one more Zeus, one more Hammer. Porcupines, in order to defend. And the Zeus is going to die. Okay, there we go, the Hammer. That as well. Affirmative. Do we have any heroes anywhere? Do we have heroes? No heroes at all. Nope, no heroes. Yay! There you have it. So together we attack Teal from the sea, Blue is uh, being mauled over here, and they surrender, but uh, there's one thing you can do when playing with Carson, and that's doing contracts, he simply chooses the victory, so uh, uh, while I'll uh, know that by now, uh, <laughs> I was a little bit too late by trying to get even walls, there you have it, victory, uh, just like that, no contracts, nothing. Okay, so all of our global conflict. Right, so let's see. Next one will be Jarvis from Dark Hunters and Gigimon 159 from the Clan Absolute. And I'm playing with Foxer, which is rank 23. Let's go! Will we be getting heroes this time? I don't know. Abyssum. Uh, right. Just speed up a lot. Fox is going to do stuff over here. And there we go. Uh, we got the C. Let's do double speed. Okay, so Fox uh, has this position. I do not have this position yet. But I'm exploring over here with the Coyote. So I had plans. Uh, conquering the sea, obviously. Um, I am. Ooh, that's a very nice mining from Fox. I should choose the torpedo platform on the shipyard. I see that mine, so I choose the torpedo platform. It's gone now. You cancel this delta. The shipyard is gone. Actually, Teal has very weak buildings. Look at this, how much damage we do. So, this is more of a contract video. Let's zoom out. Okay, so there we go. So, uh, we're producing alligators and stuff. I still think they create. They're not really that effective. I go Mass Hawk. Says Foxer, not me. And I produce lead. I'm just going to stick with doing my very best because I do not trust confed players and being weak. Yeah, they often uh, pretend. Okay, so Foxer is going to fall for that, obviously. Uh, we lost many matches before just because uh, my ally uh, stopped using boosts. 
even if you use blue that's okay but uh, no boost at all means we lose uh, but I kept golding so I'm just going to kill as much as possible as you can see blue is actually holding himself while pretending to be weak so that means they are stronger than the desiccated uh, and Foxer is simply uh, false for it so I'm just going gold boost all the way again um, I really hate it when people stop using boosts and just want to lose. I don't know why you do that. Jeez, okay, well, never mind. No, it seems straight. <laughs> anyway, okay, so Hawks flying. We deal a lot of damage on the torpedo platform and it's gone. So this time uh, I move in as well. Um, and Blue did not anticipate on that. Overpowered, going to kill him. There we go. Yeah, so uh, we obviously win this one. Uh, I am actually gathering an army over here because I do not trust anyone. Some walls, but I do not trust walls either. They are sad walls. They got sad lives. So two bunkers. Okay, so he vertex flies in in order to defend against my Jaguars. And he's dead. Oh, it's flying from Foxer. And... They live! Okay, there are some typhoons and I'm just going to kill Green now. Uh, yeah, that would be about it. No heroes at all. Just kill him. Let's kill. Boom, 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 boom. As if they suicide. Oh! Well, Teal blows himself up for a big portion. Uh, I'm not sure if I'm going to do any contracts, but uh, oh, that's right. Uh, the Grenada needs to kill Bellings contract, and uh, I had another one with those boosts. Yeah. Okay, so uh, Foxer has a contract with Don he needs to destroy the 30 buildings. There are five over here. He's going to make use of it. Uh, that's right. I made a smiley. <laughs> Um, uh, uh, I forgot the name. Uh, alligator smiley. Yeah, that's that's the word. Alligator smiley. No, uh, the alligator smile. All right. So I guess uh, we're going to the next match. Um, I think this is the one where I use heroes. We're uh, going to play against Hussein from the clan Your Death and uh, Leek Maxima uh, Ma Maxamet Maxamet from the clan Your Death. Okay, let's replay. Let's go. There we go. Resistance against resistance against resistance against resistance. I'm purple. Uh, but who was I playing again? Uh oh. Wait. Excuse me. <laughs> yes. Exit. <laughs> Completely forgot. <laughs> who was my ally? Who was my ally? A Cuba. Okay. <laughs> I'm so sorry. Okay. Let's speed this up quickly. Let's have fun. So, what's so special about this one? Well, I am in it. And Hukuba. Hukuba is going to take some praise and stuff. And, uh, well, they were very strong opponents. Even Hukuba had a little bit of trouble. They pretend to be weak as well. But they are just going to tag up. Red is 2-2. Two, two. Yellow is 19. But really, I have respect for uh, Yellow. And Red is going to do one against two. Okay, so as you can see, I'm going for the heroes in this one. That's why it's uh, being the hero video. Um, I should speed up to the moment. I'm going to use it actively. So, what was my goal? I needed to get a, a Leviathan within 10 minutes. As you can see, I'm at the fourth minute now. Actually, this is the fifth minute. Of, uh, just started. Yeah, one more crate, completely forgotten. Uh, another thing uh, I'm going to do is getting Chameleons ASAP. Because I'm go I've got the h color 4 anyway soon. And uh, I'm going to have one factory produce Jaguars. While that would be about it. Okay. Meanwhile, um, Red is going to get a massive base first before he's going to produce units. And that's his mistake because this gives a Kuba time to produce whatever he needs. Just a few factories and uh, let's speed up a bit. Yellow has a, bit, a big base as you can see. 
Yes, it is a subterranean uh, factory. Ah, no, it popped up. Okay, so scouting his base. Yes, some more shit. And uh, I'm going to uh, wait a little bit. For, okay, so apparently I got my H4 now. Upgrading it to my prototype factory. Getting my tier 3 uh, special vehicle factory. I'm already producing Jaguars. Got some infantry as father. Producing more factories, one more special vehicle factory for Porcupine, and two more factories in order to speed up my Jaguar. Because I have a lot of resources, but once my Leviathan is finished, yeah, I'm not producing it yet. Scott point B. Oh, that's right, that's a tier three special vehicle factory as well. Okay, so I got my Leviathan into production. What a time, jeez. <laughs> uh, I am producing a chameleon. This guy knows he's screwed. Somehow he's a guess, but he's doing his very best. Respect to that. Okay, so, okay, so he actually went uh, for an army. Well, I'm just getting uh, my uh, Leviathan. It's still another minute. I am gold boosting still on the resources, but. I want to get some time, and I'm going to come and attack, and activate my chameleon, then my chameleon front is trying to, uh, oh he's retreating, he lost Jaguars, he is retreating, that's smart, very 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 intelligent, this is a good very intelligent player. The porcupines are standing over there, just shooting at the cute. Okay, the cute was not very intelligent. Those elements are not very intelligent. I managed to kill the porcupines. There we go. Meanwhile, um, the cube is getting desperate. And I am going to take the high ground over here. Just exploring a little bit. I know there's a sniper tower. The sniper tower knows that I am here. And he's standing and welcoming me with an army. And I retreat a bit because I do not have enough. He wouldn't have just had to take that on. He should have known, he could have hunted a bit. My chameleon is going to run out of power soon. Meanwhile, I could have getting these crates. And getting this one, all crates are yours. I'm dealing with rank 19 and uh, that's rank 22. Yeah. But the could has a lot of hogs. During chameleon as well. Wow, okay, this is a lot of fog. Um, so this guy has been exploring and discovering this Jaguar. Okay. Uh, okay, so I got two chameleons, four Jaguars, and a Leviathan. No anti air whatsoever. Is it going to bind me back? No. Okay, so uh, this is going to be exciting. Okay, so he has a porcupine shooting at my Leviathan. And I know that there's armies over here. Yeah? Launch the nuke, and uh, this is clearly a player that is inexperienced. <laughs> he's driving forward, he's doing it very bad in defense. He lost most of his Jaguars already. They're all softened up. Oh, and Akuba is assisting! Okay, uh, okay, here's the mole. The mole's dead as well. And he's gone. Okay, so clearly, he's dead now. Wow, how did we get to that uh, cooperation? I think Yakuba saw his chance and just going to kill Yellow so that I could help him with Red. Because he's simply camping because Red is very strong. Okay, there it is. Red is going to attack. Meanwhile, I'm uh, killing Yellow. If you don't mind. Uh, Vietan and uh, Jaguars. And uh, there was a mole. And uh, Kuba has. No heroes, only me and yellow. Maybe Red is going to use a hero. Anyway, Red is using Chameleon. Against the Chameleon. I could have two Chameleons over there. Five Jaguars. It's attacking ground as well. They're both attacking ground. Both missing a lot. It's just exciting adventures of attack the ground and miss everything. And then the smoke and weed and everything. Yes, oh, the third chameleon is arriving. It's going to activate soon as well. The hog is flying over, not knowing what to do. Oh, and fog is gone! Where did he go? I'm using a blue common attack, but okay, yellow is dead, obviously. Thanks to the Leviathan. Red is retreating. Run, little chameleon! Run! No, don't come back! 
Wow, okay, you could manage to kill one of them. So there's only one chameleon left, and so yeah. Uh, in that cloud. Can you see it? Okay. Um, but there are no heroes present anymore. Poor guy. No, there's not the valid hero video actually. Well, okay. Wait. Look, I'm using a hero! This video counts as using a hero! It, it's actively used! I actually managed to nuke an army! And therefore I got in! Despite the fact that he was only rank 19! Attack point D, Akubas! I will do so! Yeah, that's. Oh, that, oh. Glitchy! A lot of jaguars over here. I even see Pokemon fire, I guess. There is the Pokemon, he's going into the fog. Another Jaguar. Okay, so he's actually attacking a Koopa now. Is he going to move in? I'm going to. Observe my Levit. Okay, I'm, I'm using a lot of wrong boosts here. <laughs> I'm just going to move in. Ta 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 ta. Akuba can't do much, so Red thinks he's doing fine. Then there it is. There he is. My Leviathan. He's taking a lot of damage, but I don't care. Okay, there we go. The nuke will do much damage. I don't know. Let's observe. Well, that factory died from just less than one third. Wow. So it was only a quarter of damage. Okay, retreating the Leviathan. And that would be about it. Look at them going uh, backwards, sideways, I don't know. Ta -ta. I am doing a stunt. Oh, 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 not a glitch. Actually, I got the feeling it's almost landing on the ground. So hovering very close to the ground over here. What the heck? Is this normal? Should I observe from another direction? Oh yeah, she's flying much higher. That's a bit. <laughs> That's just how we view it. Okay, so look at the distance between the shadow and the Leviathan. If you look like this. Where's the shadow? There it is. I zoom in a bit. No shadow victory! Yeah, we don't care about how we blow ourselves up. Anyway, there you have it. That was my last two against two at the resistance side. I hope you enjoyed. They certainly did not because they all lost. I did not enjoy this one either. So there you have it. Leave a like, share and subscribe if you have not done so yet. Comment down below. I appreciate comments. And just keep watching my videos. Thank you all for watching, see you next time, bye bye.